supports every person in the school. Every day, you're gonna see him visit myself, Ms. Sturdivant, in every classroom and see what it is that we need from him. My job, the way I look at my job, and this is kind of how I've tried to do anything I've done, is I'm like the glue. Anything that needs to be done, if it's cutting grass, if it's painting, if it's subbing in a classroom, like say somebody's out, whatever, I kind of feel like I've the puzzle piece that fits in where it needs to fit in. He does any, anything for kids, anything to, for morale, anything for the, the school culture, that is Brad. And we need more Brad Manleys. I think the first thing people would say about Brad is that he is always smiling. He is not a um, overt person where he's drawing a lot of attention to himself, but always very calm and pleasant and with everyone that he interacts with. I just like to help them out when they need something. You know, teachers ask for something, chair or table, and I don't mind going and find one for them. Uh, just kids, they, they're always, uh, like I said, they're, they're the, I guess, the driving force of this job. You know, just... Even our students know that Mr. Brad's there if they need something, and um, it's just great to see our school work as a team. If you're in the building, you're one of our educators because you're always Kids are looking up to you, they're watching you, and I know that he's setting a good example for them. Misty Luter is literally the heartbeat of Wilsonville Elementary School. And while Misty Luter is the bookkeeper, um, we wear many hats at Wilsonville Elementary School. Many times she's answering the phone, she's greeting parents, and she always does it with such a gracious heart, with a smile on her face, and really a concern for the person on the other side of the line, the person in front of her, and that really does um, set forth that heartbeat of who we want to be at Wilsonville Elementary School. Uh, even on the worst day, it's a good day here at the Ville. It's great. Even in my little spectrum, you know, I still feel it, it's all about the kids. It's all about the learning. It's all about knowing that when they leave here that they know that they were cared for, you know, in their future endeavors and that they're little leaders. So that's what we try to do. Everybody wants to be part of Misty Luter's life and wants her to be part of their life because she adds value everywhere she is and with every interaction that she has. When Mr. Wilson's bus arrives at school and the students begin exiting the bus, he always has words of encouragement. You see him giving high fives or fist bumps. When you, when you get a big hug on the neck or you know something like that, they, they, they want to talk to you, you know. Um, you know, that's what matters to me. Uh, I, I started out, you know, just thinking it was just driving a bus, but it's not. Uh, I do hair, you know, I do, I tie shoes, do, I tie, put on jackets. You know, I do a little bit of everything uh, for these babies. And uh, it's so much more than just driving because, uh, you know, they want to talk to Mr. Wilson you know, I'm here to talk to them and they know that and they know I love them. And uh, that's, you know, for me, that's that's the best part. Uh, when they get a smile on their face and you put it there. Uh, and I love each and every one of these babies. I mean, I wish I had more time to spend with them uh, as that goes. He shows up and he is such a positive um, role model. So regardless of any circumstances he's going through, he is here and he still gives his job 100% and I think that we could all take a little bit away from that. Well, Miss Vick is a, obviously a team player. Uh, she is always willing to help anybody, uh, her colleagues, her, our students. Uh, she's a friendly face in the front office. I mean, she just loves our campus and you can see that ex exuberate through her in the job that she does. Because you never know who's going to walk in that door. A parent, a student, a co-worker. They may have a bad morning and you can just greet them with a friendly smile, a kind word. So yes, that makes my day knowing that I'm going to be the first person they may see. So. You see her one-on-one -on -one with a student and it's just that you can see that she's kind of a motherly figure as far as that goes and just has genuine care and concern. And you need that for your front office because that's the first face that they see. That's the first face that parents interact with. That's who they call 
And so you, you hear that in her conversation. She's just polite, respectful, kind, um, and just generous. She's such a part of the whole school. She's not just in the cafeteria. She's not just in the kitchen. She's everywhere. She helps in the mornings with, with students. She'll go to any kind of event. She'll be at ball games. She stays late to help with other events. She's just a part of the school. The best part of my job is being able to interact with my students. I love my students. I love being able to interact with them. I love being able to step out from behind here and being able to talk with the students and getting to know the students. Just her heart. She, she loves everyone and everyone's a part of the big family. She checks on students, she checks on teachers, she checks on me. She's just part of the family and that's why we love Miss Bailey. Walter is a role model for our students. He greets him and he says, Si, if he sees students walk and dance, and Walter will join in and do a dance with them. I'm the type of person that like to do things for kids to try to make sure they stay happy all the time. So most time I'm here, all of them know me, so I had to give them a high five or shake my hand or something, you know, so that it, it's not too many kids that walk past me without trying to give me a hug. Or, a dap or something, you know, so. I mean, he just loves his job, he loves people, and he loves being around both the faculty and the students. So he's an all-around great guy and a great support person of the year. Nurse Stone has been at our school for over 20 years. She always shows the students that she cares for them. They trust her, they talk to her in the hallways, she goes to classrooms and checks on them if they're, they've been ill. She's going to look out for their needs and make sure that they're well taken care of. I've been lucky enough for the oldest child to come through. Then you get the next one. And sometimes you even get the third or the fourth child. So you feel like you know the family. And then just like I got transitioned up to the high school when we were hit with a tornado. So I was able to see my former students all, um, you know, in high school acting like grown-ups and just really proud of them to be a part of that. You know, it would be difficult to put into words how much we appreciate Beth Stone. And I wish that everybody else could just see what she does. She always laughs, but she says, I love my job. And she says, I'm so blessed. And, you know, and then I turn around and say, no, we're blessed because we are so thankful for you and all you do for us every day.